Hello, welcome back to Craft Beers of Sydney. My name's Sam and this is day four of 25 Beers of Christmas. Uh, thank you very much to my seven subscribers. Together we've racked up nearly 50 views of these uh, four beers of Christmas so far. Three beers, fourth one today, so thank you very much. Um, hopefully this video will be slightly better quality uh, recording than the, than the previous ones. Um, big night of YouTube last night, uh, watching how to how, basically how to use a, a, a Nikon or a Nikon D5200. So I followed all of the instructions from the video. This is set up exactly how it told me to get it set up. Set up. So fingers crossed, hopefully this works. So beer number four. This I've had this before. It's pretty good. Uh, very hoppy. Fixation Obsession IPA, uh, Obsession Session IPA. So it's actually very, very tasty. Now, excuse the, I'm in a slightly different position. It's not very sunny here today and it's a bit later in the evening. Therefore, the lighting is terrible. Yeah, I know. So. Now that smells a bit like ganja. All of the hops. It takes me back. It smells good. So let's see how it pours. Good carbonation. Lovely colour. Look at that. I really, really, really like the Fixation Squish, which is a citrus IPA. That is absolutely delicious. So, let's give it a smell. Doesn't smell as weedy, gangery, in the glass as it did in the bottle, but yeah, smells good. Let's give it a gulp. Yeah, it's nice. So it says it's somewhere between a pale ale, where a pale ale meets an IPA, and I'd kind of agree with that. It's kind of really quite crisp and refreshing, very sort of drinkable, like a, like a pale ale. And it's got that kind of like, really sort of tropical kind of hoppy vibe coming through, like, like an IPA. I think um, if you are, if you know anything about drinking beer or craft beer or the different types, please uh, let me know. I'm just going on what I've sort of picked up the past year or so of drinking interesting beers. That actually leads me on to um, something else I found on YouTube last night: the Beer Cartel, who are doing the the beer advent calendar. They are also doing 25 beers of Christmas, so shout out to Beer Cartel if you're watching this. Um, what they're doing is kind of awesome. They are interviewing the brewers, and the brewery, every day for the bottle of beer that they have in the advent calendar. Now that is next level. I'd love to, to get to that point at some point in the near future meet some brewers so if you're watching this and you are and you do brew beer I know there's only seven subscribers but I don't know who you are if there's any kind of ninja brewers out there do um, slide into my DMs that's what the kids say um, send me a message if you want to hook up I'd love to understand a little bit more about the brewing process um, how you brew different styles um, yeah please let me know. I'd, I'd love to come and buy you lunch or buy you beers and learn a little bit more. And that's really what this channel is all about. Um, like I said, I don't really know a lot about the 
science behind beer, but I know that there's particular types of beers that I like to drink. So I would like to connect with people that know a lot more than me uh, about beer to help me on my journey to become, you know, slightly more knowledgeable than I am today. So enough, well, you know, waffling. I'm just going to drink some more of this. It smells a bit flat, but look at that head. It's really creamy, like it's thick. It's quite solid. Really gulpable. They had these on tap actually um, down the road at the Longville Hotel about six months ago. Really quite nice. Oh, that's nearly gone already. Blimey. It's nearly seven o'clock and I've been gagging for a beer for hours. So let's. Um, Let's finish this. Oh, yummy. Let's grab the old uh, untapped and check it in. Now here's 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 a problem, right? That was good. But was it great? I really, really, really like their Squish, their Citrus IPA. Just take a little picture. There we go. Boom. Um, their Citrus IPA, I really, really rate. It's like a hot day, super smashable. And that's really nice. Is it as good as a pale ale we had the other day? Yeah, maybe. Is it as good as the Bao Bao we had yesterday, the milk stout? Probably. I'm gonna put it at 3.5. It's not, it's not as nice as that pale ale we had the other day. The Bao Bao we had yesterday, 3.75, very good, nice baby milk stout. Um, I think I like my IPAs a bit bigger, I like that, the Nitro IPA, sort of like really big and thick, but that is thick. Now nah, we're, we're changing, 3.75, don't know if the camera's picking that up purchased from Beer Cartel, so that's getting checked in. So, a lot of waffling in this video, sorry about that. Um, still trying to get to grips. Fun fact, um, average viewer watches this for about 3 minutes and 33 seconds. Now, this is approaching eight and a half, nine 9 minutes already, so 66% of you have probably already dropped out, so hey-ho, um, no biggie. Those that are still here, thank you very much for watching Craft Beers of Sydney. This is day four of the 25 beers of Christmas. My name's Sam. Please come back tomorrow for more beers. Okay, um, thank you very much and we'll see you soon. Bye.